Hey guys, Streaming or Accor Veteran here, back with a quick video. Um, this is going to be showing people that not all CVTs, rubber band or whatever the hell they're trying to explain there. Hang on, after this turn you'll be able to see my tachometer. The Sentry, yes, it does rubber band, big time. It'll wind right out before it fucking goes to another gear. Well, gear ratio, let's put it that way. But as you can see here, until it wants to change the gear ratio, my car goes smooth. It doesn't sit there and rubber band. The only time that this RPM and shit goes up and down is when I sit there and press on the gas. Like, if I go around this guy, put a little bit of acceleration into it, as you see, it's not rubber banding. I don't lose power. This transmission is actually very smooth. I'm really fucking speeding through here, but you get the point. This, not all of the transmissions do that rubber band effect crap. They really don't. And I don't know why, you know, some people think that they know everything about all the transmissions and, you know, CVTs work differently. They have the same general concept, but they do things a little differently, each one of them for each manufacturer. It's just ridiculous for people to sit there and think that all these just rubber band because that's what they think. Unless you've actually used every single brand, I highly doubt you know what the fuck you're talking about. Because you don't. This transmission doesn't rubber band. The Sentry, yes, it does. This one does not. In the Ultima, it's a smoother ride. It doesn't do that winding out crap as you're starting to go. I'll drift back a little bit, and then I'll accelerate on a straight, and I'll show you. If it was the Sentry, like the, that Sentry that I got for a loaner car a while back, yeah, it does. As you can see there, even on a easy acceleration, it doesn't rubber band. If you get a good CVT that's set up properly and has the right options, then it doesn't rubber band. But the smaller cars with the CVTs, yeah, they do. I can even come to a stop from here. I'll wait for that guy to go, and then I'll go. But I hate the CVT in the uh, Nissan Sentra, because yeah, that one, that smaller car did rubber band. This one, does not. Now, when it shifts down like that, it's just changing the gear ratio. That's not rubber banding. And I don't know why, you know, I think his name was like Doc Winner or some dumbass name like that. He just straight up thinks he knows everything about cars, obviously. He's like that idiot Scotty Kilmer. I don't fucking like him one bit either. Since I'm the first one in line up here, I'll do it one more time. But this time I'm going to accelerate more. This one does not wind up and then do that. Fucking idiot. I hate the, all these stupid morons that do the uh, California stop crap. But from here I'm at a red light right now. I'm going to accelerate medium. See, mine acts like a regular transmission, even though it's a CVT. So, for all the people that think that, you know, all these CVTs just rubber band because they had one person had one experience with one that did, doesn't mean that they all do. Now, I'll show you once again once I get onto this next road here.
which is actually my road. Just further proof that, you know, not all transmission, CVT transmissions rubber band. And once I get straight, I'll accelerate and show you. See, mine acts like a regular transmission. And that was like three, like half or three quarter pedal, all the way up to about 60 miles an hour. So sit there and tell me that all CVTs, uh, rubber band when you're just being stupid and being an idiot, knowing you don't sit there and you've never used every single CVT, that you're just being an idiot. I only know about this one, the CVT in this Nissan and the CVT in the Nissan, uh, Sentra and the Ultima. This one's the Ultima. And this one does not. But the CVT in the Sentra, the smaller car, does big time. But this one does not. This one has computer programming in along with it that makes it act like a regular transmission. And I think the name of this CVT is like their Xtronic or some shit like that. Alright guys, streaming Rack War Veteran and hope to see you again soon. Have a good one.